kids let's move on to language time come on see everybody stand up now everybody stand up let's sing abcd rhymes come on a b c d e f g h i j j k l m n o p l m n o p q r s t u v w x y z x y z butter on your bread if you don't like it go to bed next monday morning come to school i will teach you a b c a b c very good super kids okay kids in the last class what are the patterns we had seen what are the patterns we had seen come on let's revise once again come on see what is this pattern what is this line come on you say what is this line top to bottom standing line very good top to bottom standing line next what is this line what is this line come on left to right sleeping line everybody repeat come on left to right sleeping line next what is this line Yes, good job. Right to left, left to slanting line. Everybody say right to left, left to slanting line. All of you say right to left, left to slanting line. Next, see here. What is this line? Right to left. Sorry, left to right, right slanting line. What is this line? Left to right. right slanting line okay kids next next what pattern we are going to see today see here what is this pattern everybody look at here what is this pattern yes it looks like a c am i right yes today we are going to see the c pattern all of you say what is this pattern everybody look at this pattern come on this is C pattern. Yes. See, everybody trace it. This C pattern. Come on. We need to start from the top to bottom. See. Okay. What is this pattern? C pattern. Everybody say. What is this pattern? C pattern. Come on. Come closer. Come on. See here. What is this pattern? C pattern. See. It's like a C only. It's like a letter C. This is a C pattern. Okay, kids. C pattern. Come on. It looks like a C. This is a C pattern. This is a C pattern. Okay, kids. Can you understand what pattern this is? C pattern. Okay, kids. Come on. Let's move on to written part. How to write the C pattern in your language note. Okay. Okay, kids. Let's move on to written part. See here how to write the C pattern. Okay, kids. What is this pattern we are going to see now? C pattern. It's like a letter C. It's like a letter C. Okay, kids. So, ma'am, now I'm writing. You see here. Everybody, you keep your pencil on the. red line in your red line see here see you keep your pencil on the red line see so you are little bit down see it's near to red line see how to start see here so you have to use the only three lines you should use only three lines see here it should be start so little bit so red line see see here come on so it will be little bit down to red line see here once again see little bit it keep it down or else see here it should be starts with red line see this is what pattern c pattern say once again c pattern this is c pattern see you should be start from the red line you should be start from the red line only you have to use the three lines only okay kids see 
you have to use only three lines. See, ma'am, how I'm writing here. Your pencil little bit down to red line. See, little bit down. See, it's not exactly on red line. So little bit down, and you have to go to see. You go on the red line, and you put a curve. You put a curve, and you again you have to put a bend in the second blue line. Okay, kids, can you understand now? See, little bit down to red line. So you keep your pencil little bit down. See, little bit down. See, down to red line. Then you go on the red line and you put a curve. And you have to put a again curve in second blue line. Okay, kids. Second blue line. Let's read once again. Come on. Little bit down to red line. Little. See. Next you go on the red line. And you put a curve and come down up to second blue line. Second blue line. Can you understand? Little bit down to red line. See? Then you go on the red line and put a curve. See here? I'm writing over here. Come on. See? Little bit down to red line and go on the red line and you put a curve and See, and you have to finish it up to second blue line. Up to second blue line. Okay, kids, can you understand? Can you understand, baby? Can you understand? Yes, I hope everyone you understand this concept. So, in your language note, you have to. So, in the language note, you have to divide it into three columns. Okay, kids, in the three columns, you have to. Write the C pattern in one page. Okay kids, can you understand? Yes, you have to divide it into three columns. You have to write the pattern C. You have to finish the pattern C. So, every day you need to take a practice in patterns. Then only we can move on to letters. So, pattern is very very important. If you, are, if you know the pattern very well, you can write the letters clearly. Okay kids, bye bye. Is he on?